Welcome back, Chronics, and thanks for joining me. Today we're talking all about physical therapy and how it shouldn't hurt and we should make progress. Has anyone had that experience? No, me neither. Yeah, same boat. I actually recently did PT myself, and even though my PT was great and I did the lowest level possible on everything, I still was in a ton of pain until my next appointment and then the cycle would rinse and repeat. This husband and wife from Rhode Island developed something called the Muldowney Protocol. They treat about 125 patients a week. So I think they've cracked the code on building up EDS patients and having them be pain-free and successful. So, kudos to them. Luckily, the Muldownies do do telehealth visits. So the Muldownies can identify other comorbidities we have that are preventing us from having success in physical therapy or just in life in general. So. They wrote a book with their whole protocol because people kept asking them, how do you motivate someone who's already in pain? In the first step, they focus on toning, not strengthening quite yet. They are aiming to get rid of inflammation, so they use muscle activation and muscle pumping, essentially isometric exercises. The Muldownies recommend starting at your sacral joint in your back and then building up from there. This is a progression of the exercises. If you're already working with a physical therapist, you can just print this off, give it to them and be like, we should probably go in this order. One exercise we should all be doing because of our atrocious posture is just simply standing against the wall for a minute with your shoulders back, your butt and your abs squeezed in, and you try to tuck your chin. By doing this, you can leave that forward head posture up to a half an inch a month. The Muldownies are big on taping using KT tape to stabilize those joints so when you start exercising, you don't further injure yourself and pop your joints out. The Muldownies want to remind us not to go too fast to build up because if we get to that step too early, we're just going to fail again. If you can finish the book and do the whole Muldowney protocol, by the end of it, you should only have to do these sets of exercises three times a week, which sounds completely doable. Thank you again for joining me, Chronics, and remember to stay strong, don't give up, and we don't take crap from anyone. I will see you guys next time.